Hey kid, me, uh, me am a mem Team Rocket member, kind of guy. Come from another country, a trainer number one, me. This is a little racist. <laughs> um, I guess, not really, but still. Icy wind. Yeah, fuck you. Machine part, steal by me, hide it, I did, in gem of the cerulean. Inside water, put it, I did, look for, in water, center, of gem at. Boy, but you forget me not. Beat you for sure. Will Team Rocket come from Johto? Will they? Mine friends, yes. Will revenge? They are. You say what? Team Rocket, bye bye. A go go. Broken, it says you. Oh no, should I do what now on from me? Blah. Like, I'm a grammar Nazi. This is not a fun game anymore. I don't like this game. Let's go to the gym. I don't know, he, he said some bullshit. I'm glad I actually read that. Or else I would have no idea what to do here. Whoops. Um, machine part, okay, that's, this is dandy. Um, okay, so now let's go, and, uh, whoops. Whoop, damn it, I'm stuck, okay. Um, wrong way, gotta go up more here. And, okay, so, zoom. and this should be pretty easy to just derp through really quick, um, whoops, damn it, um, and now I can actually fix this, and then we can get the radio tower going at some point, and then I can get the Poke Flute channel, and then I can get Snorlax out of the way, and then I can get to Pallet Town, which pretty much means I can beat the rest of Kanto, because, I wouldn't mind beating the other uh, gyms in Kanto during this sit-down, you know? Because that's the only thing that's keeping me from doing that, is being able to get to Pallet Town and all of that shit, so... Um... Yeah, let's see, let's talk to him. Uh, ah, yeah, that's the missing part f from my beloved generator. You found it. Thanks. Here, take this TM. It's probably Zap Cannon, because that's what he said earlier. I'm, I'm, like, almost positive that's what it is. Um... Yeah, Zap Cannon, it's a powerful technique. It's not what anyone would consider accurate, but it packs a wallop. So you're saying it sucks. Um, wait, so the generator's up and everything, I guess? Since the generator's been fixed, the manager has been cheerful. Huh. Okay, that guy's really simple. We'll have to beef up our security press. Well, yeah, I mean, if some guy just could walk in and take the shit and leave, you know... You guys kind of suck, so... Um... Does this automatically mean that the radio stations are up? I, I doubt it, but... It doesn't look like it, so... I think I still only have, like, two channels here. Yeah, places and people and let's all sing, so... Hmm... Can I go... Maybe, can I go to the gym now? Uh, I don't think I can, but... It's worth taking a quick look at, I suppose. Um... Let's just see here... No, because I'm actually pretty sure that there was a sign somewhere that said that she, like, went to, uh, to somewhere. Cerulean City, a mysterious blue aura surrounds it. No, 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 wait, I think it was the little Pokemon League things in here. Sorry, I'll be out for a while, Misty Gym Leader. Yeah, so I don't know when the hell she comes back, but, uh, it's whatever, so, um... I guess I'm gonna go fly to Celadon. I forget what city it is that has what I'm looking for. Some radio tower thing. Uh, I don't know. Uh, this is like the game corner. Underneath this poster, there's nothing. Yeah, because I want to say in Gen 1, like underneath the poster was like the hideout for Team Rocket or some weird shit like that. Um, I don't really feel like playing this right now. I was never big on this when I was a kid. Um, and then that's where you redeem your prizes, is in that other building there. Um, not sure where else I could be going, though, so... I'll just be kind of going into random places. Yeah, like, uh, a battle without end, the biggest muncher gets it for free. That sounds like a very bad insult. The biggest muncher, you know? Like, I don't know, you're a muncher, asshole! Um, I'm just kinda checking to see if there's like a hidden item here or something, but... Um... Hmm... Let's see... No, not this way, uh... 
I'm pretty sure it's either Saffron or Celadon that I need to be in. Leaning more towards Celadon now. I mean, um, Saffron, because this isn't seeming that important, so... Yeah, let's go to Saffron, which is, like, right over here, correct? If I remember anything. Yeah, um, this place has more buildings and shit to be looking at. What's this place? Sylphco, that's it. That's what I was supposed to be going to, I think. Let's talk to her. Welcome, this is Sylphco's head office building. Cool story, bitch. Um, Sylphco's latest product is not for sale anywhere yet. Well, this is a lot of bullshit. I could have sworn Sylphco was the place I was supposed to be going, though. Huh. Like, I needed to be going to them to get the radio stuff up or something like that. Um... Hmm. Well... Oh wait, no, 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 that's the exit out, that's right. Uh, what about this place? What's it? Oh, this is the, uh, magnet train. I think I still need to get a magnet, though. We'll soon depart for Goldenrod. Oh, I thought I had to get, like, a magnet and everything. Well, it looks like just getting the generator up makes it to where I can actually go to and from now, so that's cool to know, I suppose. Um, I thought that I'd have to go on a whole other shebang there to get a magnet or something. Um, what's this place? Mr. Sight? Oh yeah, I've already been through here. Um, hmm. Uh, what, what place is east of here? I honestly forgot. Like, I don't think anything. I think this just kind of takes you back on the road, like cycling road and all of that shit, so... Uh, whoops. Um... Power plant Lavender Town. Lavender Town. Have I been there? I'm trying to remember where all I've been and some of the stuff that I've done, but, uh... Let's see... Okay, so I must have been here, because I, I apparently fought that guy. I don't think that there's a radio tower here, but it's worth a check. Noble Purple Town. What's this thing? Kanto Radio Station. Uh, that's what I'm looking for. Okay, so here we go. This is this is nice. Welcome. Feel free to look around anywhere on this floor. Uh, ah, uh, you're you're the pal who solved the power plant's problem. Thanks to you, I never lost my job. I tell you, you're a real lifesaver. Please take this as my thanks. The uh, the 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 the, the Expen card. With that thing, you can tune into the radio program here in Kanto. Why does everyone say ga ha 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 when they laugh in this game? It's so fucking weird. What does this guy have to say? Sorry, but you can only tour the ground floor. Ever since Johto's radio tower was taken over by the by a criminal gang, we have had to step up our security. Makes sense. So, this is pretty cool. Now I should be able to get the Poke Flute channel. Let's just double check in here. Um, yes, yeah, so, it looks like I got some other channels and junk. Not that many still. Kanto, you need to step up your programming lineup here. Um, wait a minute. Wait, okay, the Poke Flute. That's the only one I need right here. So it's playing right now. All I need to do, this is, this is so cool now because now I can actually do shit. I can actually further myself in the Kanto stuff, so... Yes, that's the technical term, Kanto stuff. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go to this fucking Snorlax piece of shit. Okay, Poke Gear. Radio. Okay, come on. This is awesome. Poke Gear was placed near the sleeping Snorlax. Wait, I just now realized I don't have that many Pokeballs. Oh shit. <laughs> Which, I think, I want to say there's one more Snorlax, but I forget, honestly. I think I have enough to catch this. Oh shit, level 50? Good god! I should have saved before I fought this though, come to think of it. What can I attack him with that won't kill him? Freeze? I could try to get him frozen. Uh, well, oh, he'll just sleep anyway, that's that's right. What will a fly do? Uh, fly. Wow, this is gonna be annoying as hell. I don't think I have to worry about him dying anyway. If he keeps sleeping every single damn turn. Uh, fly. I'm just trying to do a little bit of damage to it. Uh, like one more fly? Ooh, shit, that, that crit. Oh my god, please don't let him get recoil from Body Slam. Please don't let him get recoil from that. Please. Please. 
Okay, he actually has leftovers, so it's whatever. Um, let me try an Ultra Ball on it or something. I was about to freak out if he got, like, shit from that Ultra Ball. Let me just see if this will catch it. I'd love to catch it. I mean, I'm pretty sure this is a one-time thing in Kanto. I forget if there's a second one or not. Let's so see. Oh my god, you fucking asshole. Um... This would be easier with Beat the Bush, come to think of it, because then I could just put him to sleep. But then again, he'll just rest anyway. So... Ultra Ball. Oh, and it looks like I caught him that time. Once his health actually gets to yellow, I freaking catch him. What should I name this thing? Like, oh, it's a male, so... Because if it was a female, I was gonna be, like, my bitch or something like that. Um... I'll just name it Storm Pal, because it's a pretty accurate representation. Um... Or I'll just name it Storm, because my character's name is Pal, so, you know. There we go. I don't think I'm gonna use it, though, just because, meh. But it is pretty high level, higher level than I thought it would be, like, holy shit. Because, I mean, I just can't think of anyone that I could legit replace it with, you know? Like, anyone on my team that I don't need- wait! Why is Beat the Bush in here? Oh, that's right, because I got Nito out of here for a little bit. Why do I not have Nito, though? I need to do some shit. Should I replace Nito for... for Storm, though? I don't know, like... I'm just looking at this shit, you know? Like, what moves does he know, at least? Um... Snore, rest, body slam, and roll out. Meh. He's really not that useful as I thought, but... I mean, he could be taught, like, strength and other shit, but meh. I don't know, it's cool to have one, but I don't think I'm gonna use it, so... Wait, but I am gonna deposit Beat the Bush. Fuck that guy, I didn't even realize I still had him in here. Excuse me. Most useless piece of shit that I trained to level 42 ever. Okay, so... Um... Nito probably isn't that high level, though, right now. 46, meh. Um... Alright, yeah, I mean, I would have Snorlax on my team before I had freaking Weeping Bell, though. So... Now we can actually go through Diglett Cave, though, which is awesome, and... Uh, who has EXP share on? Is it Nito? Uh, I don't know why I would get, have him have EXP share and then put him in the, the PC, though. Wow, he does. Wow. That was a dumb move on my part. I should have given it to someone that was actually on the team, but I guess I didn't think I'd have him on there for very long. Whatever, but now, wait, I can actually go through a few places. I can go through this area now, and... More specifically, this place, though. A bunch of Diglett popped up on the ground. It was shocking. And this will just be a quick place. I don't think I'm going to catch anything unless it's... Yeah, I was going to say unless it's leveled really high. Can't escape. I should have uh, probably healed up while I was in that Pokemon Center a minute ago. Unless there's like a Doug Trio at like... I mean, a Doug Trio at like level a million, then I'm not going to catch it. Um, and then here we go. We're almost back to Pewter City. I'm just kind of looking around here. Carbos. I could drop something for that. Um, Bitterberry. Self-cure for confusion. Might come in handy. I'm such a hoarder. Like, oh, holy shit. Um, Iceberry. Self-heal for burn. Uh, Max Elixir. Fully restores the PP of one Pokemon. Max Revive. Uh, Max Ether. I'm trying to think of just something that I absolutely do not need. I should give that to Weepin' Bell just for the hell of it or something. Metal Coat, powers up steel type moves, upgrade a mysterious box. What the hell does that do? I'll, I might have to Google that. Wait, why do I? Yeah, why do I have a potion? How about I toss that shit? And I should sell the nugget when I get half a chance. Protein raises the attack of one Pokemon. Pink Bow, powers up normal type moves. Can I give that to anyone? Just anyone? Uh, yeah, I'll give it to Stoner. I mean, he's not using anything, so why the hell not? Protein raises the attack of one Pokemon. Let me take a look at my stats of the guys. Who who has a pretty decent attack that I take advantage of? Um, stats, you know, because I'm gonna be, I'm just gonna give to the people who don't need it quite as much, I guess. To the people who will actually use it, I guess is a better way to say that. Um, I don't know. Water water moves are all special, and Gyarados, here I have him pretty much solely... I think pretty much all his moves are uh, 
special attacks, but whereas he's actually more of a physical attacker. If I get a Suicune, I probably will replace Gyarados. Like, no shit, you know, just because I think it would be a lot more useful. I'm pretty sure its special attack is a lot higher if I know anything about Pokemon, so... Probably gonna give it to Umbreon now that I'm looking at these stats for everything. Um, might give it to Nido King because he actually uses this stuff and his attack could use a little bit of a raise. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna give it to him. So, pack, um, protein, gonna give it to Nido really quick. Raise his attack a little bit. And like I said, I'll sell the up, I mean, the nugget sometime. Probably gonna put items like Miracle Seed and Metal Coat in my PC. Like, who's this? Oh my god, Gina, you freaking whore! This is Gina, where you wake, I dressed up my Hopip. Guess what happened the other day? I don't give a fuck! <laughs> oh my god. This this was the worst idea ever. Uh, Carbos. What, what, does that raise up speed maybe? I'm trying to remember what Carbos raises. Um, speed, yeah, I was right, cool. Um... I don't want to give it to, like, Raichu, because he can pretty much outspeed most shit that I need him to, so... Who who could use a little bit of a speed increase that would still be useful to them? 121 on Typhlosion, that's not as bad as I thought it would be. Uh, wait a minute, yeah. 121, I didn't realize he was that fast, like, damn. Umbreon, meh. Uh... Gyarados, meh. Yeah. Uh... Da -da -da. I'm trying to think here. So Lugia, uh, Raikou, and Typhlosion really don't need a speed boost at all, but... Uh, I would say Umbreon could use it, probably. You know, um... Hmm. I'm just kind of looking at it. I think Umbreon could use it okay, like, because his speed is high enough to where it'll actually benefit him to have it, but it's also low enough to where he can still use it, so... You know, that was fun there. Uh, what's in this little building? Um, 